there. We're saying, come on, Jim. It, it, it's a minute. Let's go. Ready to rock this thing out. Is everybody ready to rock this out? Good morning, uh, good afternoon, whenever you're doing this workout. Um, again, I was just saying, uh, I have hope, I have optimism, I have confidence that we're gonna get through this and everything's going to, uh, we're gonna learn a lot from it. With that said, when I was creating this workout this morning, I thought, wow, we all need to physically exercise every day. I have to admit, I only did 18 minutes yesterday. I didn't do the full rounds. I was in my house and kids were like, you, you know, you know how it is. Kids yelling, uh, you're sweating more than normal. Um, and uh, I thought, man, I'm doing this every day. I'm gonna get my heart cranking every day. I'm gonna sweat every single day, uh, uh, whether it be nine, 18, or 27 minutes, okay? Today, we have a little bit of cardio to warm up with, a little bit of cardio to warm up with, and then we're gonna do some weight training. I'll tell you what, 18 uh, minutes of, of resistance training and, and abs and full body workout can, you can build muscle in this workout right here. Remember, I'm doing this workout too. I'm not doing anything else. Okay, with that said, with that said, and I'm doing it in my living room, so I'm following your path. I'm not using all the fancy, you know, the heavy dumbbells and kettlebells. I got my one dumbbell. Again, I wouldn't tell you to do anything that I don't do myself. Okay, I, I can't see the camera, but I'm sure people are saying right now, Jim, let's go, get it rolling. So, one minute, XT jacks. 30 seconds forward lunge, 30 seconds of an inch, pop out an inchworm real quick, would you? And then uh, 30 seconds forward lunge, 30 seconds inchworm. Thanks, Brandon. Uh, it's the third minute, RHB, reverse lunge. Fourth minute, side squat. You're gonna start with your feet together like this and hit the squat. 10 finger rotation. Hey, have a sit, sit, sit on my little, my little uh, piece of tape there. Face the camera real quick and do like, hit all 10 fingers. Guys, is that the, yeah, 10 finger rotation for 30 seconds, okay? Everybody with me? Uh, hit it again, again, boom, boom, there's eight minutes. And then I don't know if you can read this right here, but that says reward. I'm gonna reward you after your eight minutes of cardio with 12 burpees, okay? You're welcome. Okay, and then we're gonna go over here. Hey, will you turn that heat off real quick? Thanks, Brandon, appreciate it. Uh, dumb, I, I can hear the fan too, so. Dumbbell floor to mill, dumbbell floor to mill. So remember, and I'll go over technique with the dumbbell floor to mill. So this is minute one, minute two, minute three, minute four, five, six, seven, eight, and you get to do the burps for nine twice this time, because we're gonna repeat it then. You can fatigue the muscle out, okay? Uh, so it's gonna be nine minutes, a minute, a full minute rest. Then we're gonna go here for ten, eight, eight to 16 dumbbell mill press, love what I showed you, dumbbell mill, eight to 16 push-ups, and I'll explain that range. Uh, bent over row, so single, bent over row like this. If you have two dumbbells, feel free to use them. The bent over rows, look what it says. It says six, and, and the plank rows, let me just show you that real quick. The plank rows, I think we did them earlier in the week. I'm talking louder today, because I want everybody to hear me. Uh, six to 12 each way. So when we do that, depending on how heavy you go, that's why I give you that range. If I go really heavy with a 60 pounder, six this way, six this way in a minute, and then to do uh, front squats again, takes a lot of energy, okay? So that's why I give you this range and I will talk throughout the workout and instruct and inspire and motivate and encourage. Okay, did I, did I have to do that, all that? So that's, that's getting a little ridiculous. Hey, you know what is nice to hear though, see though? If I go back and watch this on, um, on Facebook when I download it, uh, the, the live stream here, when I see like a thumb up go across, which I haven't been seeing a lot of thumbs up across, uh, it makes me feel good inside. Especially when I see a bunch of hearts just like, you know, you can go up there, XT, XT peeps. You can go up there right now and press like a like or like a heart, I think. Is there anything else between, between thumbs ups and, and hearts? I, I don't know. They all happen at the end though. He doesn't know. He's just a good, he's just a, he's just a, a fit person with a good looking face. You know what I'm saying? He just, yeah. Uh, uh, so, so what you want uh, uh, to do as I'm explaining this stuff, which we're going to start in about probably 90 seconds. Hopefully, again, my ex-tiers know, 
You're doing, you're, you're hinging, you're squatting, you're getting arm circles in, you're kicking it out to warm up. So I expect by the time we start this, you'd be thoroughly warmed up so you can even start before, you know, the, 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 the clock. So anyhow, with that said, great to have you. Let's do it. Yeah, he warmed up a little bit before, didn't he? You know, you know the ball, for those of you that don't know, I have Bulgarian blood in me. I, I just made that up actually, but the Bulgarians, they were awesome athletes. And I read an article one time where they could get out of bed. They were so primed, their bodies, they knew their bodies so well, they could get out of bed and do their heaviest squat right from getting out of bed in the morning. And they wouldn't get injured, they were that great of athletes. Anyhow, with that said, get your heart pumping, warm up a little bit before we start this. But that's what's nice about the cardio section here. We're gonna start, everybody ready to go? Is everybody ready to go? Uh, you ready to go, Brandon? I'm ready. He's ready. ready. He's ready. Look at his enthusiasm. Uh, yeah, kind of see that little green piece of tape I, right I there? I need to stand right here the whole time. Don't move. Let's knock it out of the ballpark. 100%. Up in 10. Up in 10. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. So a minute of XT Jacks. Are you ready? Let's go. So hopefully you can see the clock better. Hopefully you can see the clock better. Uh, a member of mine, Eric Stern, said, put a little something uh, shaded a little bit. Let me know if you can. Gail Steffen said, hey, uh, so thanks, Gail. What, what about blackboards with some uh, chalk? Uh, stand out and you can see the boards a little better. Hopefully you can. Uh, Sean Island, I don't want your recommendations. Another member. Thanks anyhow. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right. This is live too. I'm not editing, this is real. So if I say something dumb, sorry. And I will, in 15 seconds, forward lunges. XT jacks, gosh, you gotta love them. You know what's great about the first nine minutes? Forward lunge, let's go. Forward lunge, alt lunge, forward alt lunge. You know what's great about the first nine minutes? You can do these anywhere. anywhere. When you're standing in a supermarket line today, six feet apart, knock out a couple burps. Knock out some forward alt lunges. Knock out some XT jacks. You don't need any equipment whatsoever. You just need a good attitude. Okay, six seconds. Inchworm, inchworm in six seconds. I'm gonna let Brandon take these over. Let's go. So, inchworm. Again, keep that core tight. Look how far he goes up. That's, that's strong. If you go to the push-up position and take your palms in front of your face, even just a little bit, that's good. Keep the core tight. Keep the hips up. When I say up, don't let them, don't let them sag. In nine minutes, you have RHVs. RHV, uh, nine seconds. Sorry, not nine minutes. Ready in three, two, one, RHV. You'll get to know all these exercises. You'll get to know all the terms. Uh, some of them are XT original. Uh, you know, there's nothing new. There's nothing new under the sun. There's just different ways you can do it and call it a different name. So in nine seconds, in nine seconds, reverse lunge, reverse lunge. Ready, three, two, one, reverse lunge. The goal of this is to non-stop. The goal is to not to non-stop these movements, okay? Uh, throughout the eight the eight minutes. After the reverse lunges, after the reverse lunges, we'll go to side squats, okay? In 15 seconds. Good, good job, good job, everybody. Keep up the great work. Let's okay. Five, four, three, two, one. Start with the feet together and to the side, feet back together, side. When you're doing the squats, when you're doing the squats. Hey, face me, Brandon, would you? It's good form. Shh, look how, how he's dropping his tail now. His shoulder blades are back. That's awesome, he's going a little below parallel. Look at his thighs, he's going a little below parallel, but he's keeping that lower lumbar in perfect neutral position. Did you hear that, Lindsey Bottlemeyer? Neutral, I'm just pulling out all of the exercise fizz and biomechanics. Anyhow, three, two, 10 finger rotation, let's go. 10 finger rotation. The toughest way to do this 
is to straighten those legs out just a little. If you keep those legs straight all the way, that's the toughest. This is not easy. Again, you can rest when you need to because right after this, in 13 seconds, we have another minute of XT jacks. Another minute of XT jacks. Who wants to be the guest worker outer tomorrow? Three, two, one, let's go. Okay. Seriously. Message me underneath. Just leave a drop your name. Who wants to be the guest worker outer? I don't, is that, that's probably not proper, is it? There's a lot of pressure here, Jim. A lot of pressure. A lot of pressure not to rest, isn't there? Yeah. I'll tell you what, you get a great workout. Everybody, everybody notice how you sweat more in your living room? You notice that? There's more air flow in here than you, than, than you think, I think. 30 more seconds, 30 more seconds. Again, I want to motivate you to, yeah, does it hurt? Does this hurt to physically exercise on a regular basis? Yes, it is uncomfy. Um, it, it gets a little, uh, maybe monotonous for some people. I, I love the experience, but yeah, it hurts. What it does afterwards is all worth it. Seven seconds, seven seconds, uh, forward alt lunges, forward alt lunges. Ready, Graham, and let's go, forward alt lunges. Uh, what it, the way it makes you feel, the way it makes you feel afterwards is all worth it. I noticed when I did this yesterday, I was going, like this, and there was a bunch of wrinkles right here in my forehead. So now I'm trying to bring my face down and do that to get rid of the wrinkles. But yeah, it's worth the effort, everybody. Do it. The exercise high that you get from physical exertion is worth the effort. Don't let up now. Ready? In three, two, inchworm, inchworms. Let's go. Let's go. All right. I'm going to see what that looks like from... Okay, looking good, Peggy. Peggy, nice, nice. In 12 seconds, in 12 seconds, we will do the RHBs, the RHBs. Three, two, one, let's go, RHBs. Yeah, you, you, you do, I, I, I did notice though, uh, when I, um, you don't want to stop, do you? Because then everybody at home is going to say, why is Brandon rested? Hey, why is Brandon rested? Doesn't he work out there all the time? Is this, is this hard for him? My brother's like, after yesterday's workout, my brother's like, hey, I'm not doing it tomorrow, man. I'm too tired. <laughs> nine seconds. Nine seconds. And we'll go to the reverse lunges. The reverse lunges. And I'm going to talk about the difference between forward and, and reverse lunges here. And let's go. Reverse lunges. First of all, rest when you want to. You can do 15 seconds of each and take 15 seconds off. We're all at different fitness levels. The goal of this program is to get people moving, keep them consistent, and be, have to be accountable to, to somebody. So get a partner, get a friend, and say, hey, I'm gonna do Jim's video tomorrow at 9, 15, whatever. Be accountable to each other because it is worth it. Again, more than ever do we need to exercise in this, this day, keep, keep strong. Get ready for side squats, get ready for side squats. And let's go. Okay, here, here's what we have. We have the last minute. We have the last minute of exercise here before you get your reward. Reward. Fitness, remember, is a reward. It's not a penalty. So when my, the only thing uh, I can think of my basketball coach, uh, not that I don't agree with, because I agree with everything Coach Baker and Coach Renz uh, said to me. Thank you guys. I appreciate both of you too. I'd like to shout out to my teachers. Ready for 10 finger rotation. Let's go. Is when you would mess up, you didn't box out, you didn't get down low in defense, they would make you run or do 20 push ups. Little did we know they were rewarding us with physical fitness to strengthen our muscle and thicken our bones and give us an exercise high. Okay, I won't talk as much. 13 seconds, and then you get rewarded with 12 burpees. In fact, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the 12 burps with everybody. Sounds good, just to get, get a little shot of, a shot of fitness in. Okay, let's go. I sped my burpees up there at the end just to beat him. Uh, okay, good job. Take a breather. Take a breather. 
Take a breather. You know what? Here, here. Okay, so here's the deal. You ready for this? You have the rest of the minute to rest. Plus, I'm giving you about one full minute, okay? So you have a lot of time. You should be nice and warm right now to prep and get your weight out. Get your weights out, whatever you need. Again, if you have more, hey, tell me not to say again. Remind me, Brandon, not to keep saying again, again, again. Thanks. Real, everybody, this is real. I'm not cutting it and retaking. So uh, here's what we're gonna do. In 45 seconds, I'm gonna reset the clock uh, for, nine, for nine minutes, okay? I'm gonna reset the clock for nine minutes. And uh, we're gonna start with eight to 16, eight to 16, dumbbell floor to mill. Do a dumbbell floor to mill real quick, just, just three of them. Pull it up to your body, yeah, yeah. When you do the dumbbell floor to mill, just do one more. Look how close that dumbbell is to his chest. Bam, he's popping his hips into it. Okay, that's good. And you can feel free to lighten the weight. Lighten if you need to. There's a 35 here. The, uh, if you have a kettlebell, if you have a kettlebell, you can pop it here. And we'll, we'll talk, we'll talk, we'll talk here. You ready to go? Up in 10 seconds. Now, eight to 16, dumbbell floor to mill. I give you that range because, again, if Brandon did eight, that would be tough. And I would say, let's go, let's go, Brandon. Get it again. Now, we're gonna go through this twice. So you can either do four each way to get your eight, six each way to get your 12, seven each way to get your 14, or when we come back around the next time, you can work your other side. Does that make sense? Yes, keep it that one. Do, do eight to, with that weight, Brandon, I'd say eight to 10. Eight to 10 is all you need. Because remember everybody, we're, we're doing some resistance training here. We don't have a lot of recoup time. You want at least, I would say, 25 to 30 seconds rest if you're going heavy and trying to fatigue your muscle out every time. If Brandon had a 15 pounder there, get ready for push-ups. Get ready for push-ups. If he had a 15 pounder there, he could have did probably six, 16 and had enough recoup time. Heavier weight kicks your butt. Ready for push-ups, ready for push-ups. Three, two, one, let's go. Yeah, uh, Brandon's thighs, Brandon's thighs are never touching, okay? His core is tight. Squeeze those glutes together. Squeeze your butt together when you're doing push-ups. Don't go to your knees. Did you hear that? Don't go to your knees if you want to, well, you can go to your knees, but if you're struggling with these, because push-ups are tough, I would get two chairs and elevate your push-up, and elevate your push-up, which I'm gonna, show, I'm gonna walk off the, the stage here real quick. Yeah, good job, good job. Get ready for bent over rows. That's a bent over row. And if you choose to do your bent over rows, all 10 or 12 with one side, remember, do your right side or something because we're gonna come back around and do the other side, okay? Rest when you need to. This is a lot of movements. Cut the reps down if you're going heavy. Ready, Brandon? And let's go. I'm gonna show you a push up on a box next time. Yeah, yeah. Keep that core tight. Keep that core tight. So you can see me. The difference between bad form and good form, look at my low back, everybody. Look at my low back, watch this. Slight bend in the knees, throw the hips, tilt the hips up. Take the, open the chest up. Open the chest up. Hips back, open the chest up. Okay, 30 seconds left before the plank rows. Get in push up position, plank rows. And again, I probably am gonna go right side the whole time, and then when we come back around, since we're doing it twice, I'll go left. You can do six each way, seven each way, eight each way. Again, I'm giving people a range. Ready, Brandon? And let's go. The reason I'm giving people a range, because the people that are really going super heavy, that's a lot of repetitions. People that are going super light, you're not gonna get your heart rate up as much, maybe. It's very beneficial, but that's why I wanna give that range. I really wanna make that clear and explain that as well as possible. And feel free to ask me any questions anytime. Yeah, Brandon, again, rest when you need to. You're working hard. Uh, 
gosh darn. Again, I would never ask you to do anything I don't do myself. I'll be doing this around, I think we're doing it at 10 a.m. today, actually. My, my, my wife and I. Okay. Wow. How you feeling? How you feeling? I'm just kidding. He said it's spectacular. Woo! Suck it up, dude. Suck it up. <laughs> uh, 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 front squat. Hey, adjust your weight. If you have a kettlebell, I'd hold that kettlebell right here. Flip it up. Get your palms underneath it. Shoulder, elbows up. Keep it close to your chest. Kettlebell front squat or dumbbell front squat. Check out how he holds the dumbbell. And let's go, Brandon. Gosh. Picture perfect. Picture perfect form. I'm not getting too close to him. I'm, I'm really still trying to social distance. I want to I I stay with the program. Stay with the program. But tailbones dropping low. Spines in great alignment. Shoulder blades are back. Open that chest at the bottom. Gosh, yes, that's great form. Stay through the heels. Stay through the heels. Again, dude, you can lighten that, those reps up, or you can uh, take those reps down a little bit. That makes sense. One, two, three, four, five. Right? Does that make sense? Where are we at? Here? Yeah, we're there. Yeah. That makes sense. We missed one. We're oh, no, we, yeah, we're okay. we have abs here. We have abs. We have abs here. Okay. See, live and real. Live and real. Uh, switch lifts. Switch lifts. I'm sorry, we didn't. Okay, ready, Brandon? Let's go. We did these the other day. I just changed the name of things all the time to confuse my members. I'm going to call this a switch lift, especially writing on chalkboard when I don't have a lot of room and I want to write it bigger. Switch lift. Gosh, this is effective. I love this exercise. You can jump because Hallie McF McFarland loves these. So feel free to jump here and do the switch squat jump. I'm going to go low impact today, okay? Uh, 8 to 16, 8 to 16. Again, if you get heavy weight and you do, you, and you do 8 or you do 10 reps, that's a lot of reps. Dude, how, how you, you, you all right? What do you need, a towel to wipe your face? Or, <laughs> no, you good? Yeah. V-ups. Do a v, get it down there and do a V-up real quick, would you? We're going to repeat this, by the way. We're going to repeat this. V-up. Keep the legs as straight as possible. Don't touch. Okay, that's good. That's good. I, I, want, I, want, I want you to rest. 12 to 16 V-ups. Uh, again, this is not easy. This is not easy. This workout's intense. High intensity. Let's go. Let's go. For those of you that, uh, for those of you that are, are, are uh, just starting out, um, watch it. First, watch the whole video first and then do nine minutes of it or pick and choose a few exercises, okay? That's great, dude. That hurts. Uh, this hurts. It takes a lot of core strength to do this. Again, 12 to 16. 12 to 16. You don't want to, the clock says 28 seconds before we hit the planksters. You don't want to go 50 seconds and give yourself a 10 second rest. Give yourself time to recoup. We're doing some resistance training here. Uh, planksters, planksters. On your elbows, get on your elbows. 12 might be a lot. 12 might be a lot. I, I might put that range at eight to 12. Ready in four, three, two, one. Let's go. All right, yeah. Yeah, Mike Atchison. Yeah, Paul Moyer. Yeah, Scotty. Hopefully you're doing it. Yeah, Laura Mather. Yeah, Dave Craig. Keep the core tight when you're doing this. Yeah, Bridget and Rob Hammer. Yeah, Sean I uh, He's not doing it. Okay, dude. Yeah. How many did you do? Be honest. I wasn't counting. I was just he wasn't counting because you know, he's, just a, he's like a machine. Yeah, he doesn't exactly. have to count. He went 30 seconds. And you know what? Sometimes I will say no counting. Kim Craig loves this. And just go 30 seconds. But I like to personally shoot for a number. Guess what? Guess what? Reward. Can you see this over here? Reward. 12 burpees. Ready. Three, two, one. You get a big break after these 12 burps. Youngster. Of course I'm going to beat him. I got a lot more experience. I'm 51. He's only 35. How are you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. 
I mean, I didn't do 12. I didn't do 12. What? Uh, but, but I wanted to explain, of course I'm going to beat him. I got 16 more years of working out experience on him. He's not going to beat me. Those youngsters. Anyhow. Rest of the minute, plus a whole other minute to rest. Yeah. Now, if Brandon stopped right now, which I did yesterday, I did 18 minutes, but man, I felt good. I was, I, my, my heart was cranking. I had an exercise high, felt more energetic. My attitude went from here to here with only 18 minutes. You have another minute to rest. We're gonna do it again. Not the first part, do it again. Um, again, mark these, take pictures of these boards. Let me know if you want me to, I can send them to you, put it on the page. Because just to knock that out, mid-afternoon, to get a, instead of doing a triple latte cappuccino, just knock that out, and you're gonna, it's gonna give you a boost. Jim, I can't do that, I, have, I wear a tie and a jacket to work, or, well, stop doing that, okay? Don't do that, I'm just kidding. Some people have that, that was dumb. Again, this is live, I'm gonna say some, I'm gonna say some, just dumb, non-funny stuff, and you're gonna wish I would just be quiet. You ready to be up there, you're up in 10 seconds from Dumbbell Florida Mill. You ready for this? Up in 10, up in 10. I'll do a few kettlebell, uh, kettlebell Florida Mill. Let's go. See how I'm flipping that kettlebell up and back. Some people say, oh gosh, that hurts my... Yeah, there is a... It, it can bruise here a little bit. I make up different names for exercises, too. You know, I just call them different because we're, we're original here at XT Fitness. We're not a copy. We're an original. Good job, Brandon. Good job. Good job. Again, Brandon's going left side now. He's just doing total left. So, 25 seconds. Push-ups. Now... Better to elevate your push-ups. Look at, if you're going here, you're, where your palms are, your chest should be right in between those palms. Don't let the hips sag. Like this, keep the hips up. Better to elevate than go on your knees because it doesn't break the kinetic chains. Kinetic chain. There you go, Lindsay Bottomeyer. Kinetic chain. Let's go. Squat. I mean, push, push up, push up. Yeah, I like it. Keep the breath flowing. Keep the breathe. Keep breathing. Um, gosh, I, I wish I would have talked about breathing more because that's changed my workouts. To focus, go into each workout and to say, "Hey, Jim, do the movement, but just focus on your breath, not holding your breath one time." I wish uh, I would have started talking about that earlier. I got, I got, I got to start taking notes and putting them on a board over there. So you think I just remember this stuff? Remind me, remind me of that, Brandon. Breath. Yeah, breath, breath. Okay, bench over rows. Did you do alt or did you do one side? One, one side, doing left. Yeah, so the brand's gonna do the dumbbell bent over rows on just his left side. If you have two dumbbells out there because you have your own home gym, grab two, two dumbbells, that's okay. One dumbbell is nice though, I'll tell you why, because it throws your balance off a little bit, works different stabilizer muscles because you have one weight here, works your core. So, not everything's always even in this world. The, uh, world, uh, the, the we, we're living in an imperfect world. Screws fall out all the time. Name the movie. Breakfast Club. John Bender. Uh, okay, anyhow. Plank rows. Plank alt rows. I love these. I absolutely love plank rows. You can alternate them or you can go the same way, whichever, wherever you're at, okay? You could do six each way, this time, seven each way, whatever. Brandon, are you doing one side? One side. Yeah, he's, he's sticking with one side. I like one side because I feel like it fatigues that muscle out totally on that side, where you can get some, 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 some growth, some, you know? Get some aesthetics. Ready and let's go. Aesthetics, just that fine muscle tone. Being in good physical shape, and having fine muscle tone is the North American definition of buff. Now who wouldn't want to be buff? 
being in good physical shape, and fine muscle tone. Yeah, Brandon Bales. Yeah, yeah, Double B. Give Double B a shout out in the comments underneath. If you're watching that YouTube, give a, give a thumbs up even there too and, and comment. Okay, so, uh, front squats. I tell you how the front squat. The front squat. If you just did 100 front squats with a dumbbell every day, that'd be a sufficient workout for you. It's that much of a great exercise, full body workout. It's functional too. Ready? Eight to 16. Eight to 16. Brandon has a 45 pound dumbbell. He's got, he's holding, he's holding some weight. If he had a uh, 20 pound dumbbell in here, there's no doubt he, he could crank out 16 and have enough recoup time for the switch lift, okay? For the switch lift. Again, I'm still practicing social distancing. Uh, I want to, I want to, I want to be, uh, I want to be smart. And I think everybody else should. You know, you, you, you yeah. I'm not, I don't want to preach to you about that. God. Yeah, just teach physical fitness. Anyhow, wow. Switch lift. How you feeling, Brad? I, you know what? Hey, I, okay, real quick here. How's my forehead? Is it they're wrinkly? Um, real quick here. Uh, I can see the light, and I'm gonna be able, I'm gonna see the light when I do this workout, hopefully with my wife and daughter at 10. Um, yeah, because you only have four more minutes to go. And wow, you did it for the day already. And let's go. Switch, lift. Again, shoulder blades back. At the bottom of that squat, through the heels. Chest should be opened up. Stand all the way up. Squeeze maybe a little glute squeeze together. Tighten up the, that core. Nice. Tell you what, you know why? You know what? You know what 30 minutes of physical exercise does every day? You know what 30 minutes of physical exercise does every day? It makes the other 23 hours and 30 minutes of the day awesome. And I don't like to use the word awesome a lot because when something really is awesome, what do you use? Uh, people use awesome way too much. But I think working out for 30 minutes is awesome because it makes the next 23 hours and 30 minutes. Just about as awesome. Okay. What are you doing? God, this is tough. I tell you, man, when you're the when you're the fitness professional, Brandon, and working out, it's in front of the camera. It's hard. Check out the V-ups. Check out the V-ups. I like it. I like it, Brandon. Excellent. If you give it the straighter the legs, this is tough. You know what another option for this is, and I should have giving you this, you can put your hands here, okay, on the floor and do a little movement like this. I, I need to be aware and start giving more, maybe some modifications uh, for some of these exercises. In 30 seconds, planksters. Now if this wasn't real and this wasn't live, I would cut it and say, hey, let's retake that last 30 seconds because I want to show them a different option. But this is real, everybody. This is, this is how I teach my classes here at XT Fitness. And I want to bring XT Fitness into your living room. Uh, ready! 12 planksters. Last set before the burpees. Last set before the burpees. Come on, come on. Let's go. Yeah, Brandon. Tighten the core. Don't hold your breath. Maybe squeeze the glutes together, the gluteus maximus together. Keep moving, push yourself, because when you push yourself at the end of the workout, that's when you get the good results. That's when you see the good results. Nice, nice job, dude. So in 25 seconds, we're gonna end with 12 burpees. And you did it for the day. You did it for the day, and I'm proud of you. I would do 9, 18, or 27 minutes of this every day. Every day. Don't skip a day. I'm going to do it every day. I'm going to do it seven days a week. Ready? Three, two, one. Burps. Let's go. Burp it out. And when I say every day, I might just get that first nine minutes of cardio in on Sunday. Uh, I, I might not do the 27 minutes full every day, okay? 
uh, you do want your body to, to have a rest, but make sure you're drinking a lot of water and you're sleeping a lot and you're getting as much good nutrition as possible, eating a lot of fruits and vegetables and lean meat. Sorry, Peggy Snapper Jones, whatever you, whatever you vegans eat. Make sure you're aware of it. Look, listen, does that sound wrong, you vegans? Like, hey, you vegans. Okay, anyhow, is that 12? 12. Okay, love those vegans. Uh, yeah, okay. yeah, 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 thanks, pal, thanks, pal. Thanks for being here again today. I would walk it out, uh, cool down a little bit, do some stretching, um, share this video. Let's spread this a, a, around the, the world for now and uh, let, everybody, uh, let everybody enjoy this so they do stay accountable to one another and get that, that exercise high. I'm done, I'm done talking. Have a great day.